Hi, I'm JJ Falkinger from Lenovo's Data Center Group, and here's some of what's new in LECO 5.5 for HPC AI administrators. Let's log into LECO 5.5 and take a look. First thing I will show you is we've added the ability to expose hardware errors from Confluent into the LECO portal, so there's a new health column, as well as when you drill into a node, a new health tab, which will show what those warning messages are from Confluent right within the LECO portal. We've also added a new feature called Cluster Reports. This gives the administrator a view over cluster use and utilization, whether users have had their jobs waiting in queue too long and capacity needs to be expanded, as well as what types of resources are being used for different jobs. It gives several views, both graphical as well as numerical, and we can look at resources, for example, both on a CPU basis as well as GPUs that were used in jobs. We've also expanded the billing capabilities of LECO in version 5.5. So billing groups can be set up by CPU core hour, as in the past, but they can also have rates against memory billing as well as GPU billing, and these can be set by the hour or by the minute. These billing rates can also be applied at the queue level. So let's say you have a queue with higher power GPUs and would like to set that at a higher rate for jobs running in that queue specifically, this is very easy to do now with LECO 5.5. The administrator can set additional discounts by user or user group as well. And these charges can be viewed graphically through expense reports or downloaded as a daily or monthly bill to an Excel file. For more information on LECO, please contact your Lenovo sales representative or business partner today. Thank you.